I'm Billy Batkins. I was the TSA advisor at Highland Springs High School here in Virginia um, for the last 18 years. Uh, and I have been involved in the flight endurance competition here for that whole time and uh, our kids have been really successful at it. I, I'm recently retired uh, and I'm still really active with the chapter. I'm still officially there, one of their advisors. I'm just not in charge anymore, which is great. And we didn't know anything about flying model airplanes. And so we just kind of figured it out together, the kids and I. Um, we've, had, we've now had five national champions. Um, we the best we ever we finished first and third in 2019. Uh, we had second and two first in the last three years uh, national conference. Um, every year I have more kids that want to do it than we have than we have spots. Uh, we can only take five kids to our regional competition and and uh, I just you know we just really like it. You know it's really fun and and the, and being competitive I found is really it's uh, it's an elixir that draws really draws kids in. We got in touch with uh, both the Brain Busters and uh, Max Executors and, uh, you know, parents from other schools that I would meet at the TSA conferences. And when you, as you can see, we have a crowd of people here from all over. We have people from North Carolina, Maryland, and all over Virginia that come to fly here. And, um, yeah, it's, it's, really, it's really fun to, to, see these kids, to see these kids compete. Uh, you know, a lot, of, uh, the way I, a lot of the kids that have been really competitive in this, for me, they're not necessarily sports kinds of kids they're kind of they're like nerd competitors and this is another option compared you know they have robotics they have other competitive outlets but this is to me a really great opportunity for them to compete and uh, you know learn to, to systematically improve and I, I really feel like uh, that the kids can learn so much about engineering and how to be engineers and how to think like engineers just through the project of this TSA airplane. Uh, you know, they learn about chemical engineering and the rubber, they learn about mechanical engineering, aerospace engineering, and just, you know, just the old fashioned thing of being able to take a drawing and make it into a part. Uh, and that's really uh, an incredible skill that not every, not every kid that wants to be an engineer has, so uh, I think it gives them a leg up.